I'm a pregnancy registered dietitian, and these are things we are not doing if pregnancy is on the list for 2024. Starting with number one, which is probably the biggest one and one that most of you are tempted to do, which is start any form of a diet or doing a New Year's cleanse or detox. For starters, cleanses and detoxes are usually void of some of the most important nutrients, and that is not something we want to do when we're thinking about becoming pregnant. Number two, most diet it's don't work. If it's not something that you want to do for the rest of your life, it is not sustainable and it's not something we even want to do for the short term. Number two is starting any random new supplements just because they are marketed towards people who are trying to conceive or pregnant. The supplement industry is largely unregulated and when it comes to pregnancy, we want to limit the amount of supplements we are taking even before we become pregnant due to this. In addition, if someone like a provider or a registered dietitian that you're working with has not prescribed it to you specifically, it's probably a waste of your money. Number three, which falls along with number one, is taking away foods that we love. Again, if we are taking away foods we love, it is ultimately going to make us want them more. There are certainly ways that you can continue eating the foods you love while still making diet improvements. And number four is taking 100% of the responsibility of getting and staying pregnant. There are two people that it takes to create a baby. Both of them are important, so if you have a partner that you are partnered with in this journey, then they should also be taking some other responsibility, at least encouraging you along in this journey at the least.